here we are playing Welcome To for the second time. I'm going to start in taking the 12, how about? And making it into a 14. I'll put that in the middle, sure. Hope for a 15 in the future. See what everybody else did with such a weird starting group of things that they could do. Um, I guess everybody put stuff up there. Alright, at the first row. Okay, LARP is... I feel like my park row is easiest to be done, like on the bottom row. I'll put it right there. And I've got nine prestige, so I'm pretty much a pro comparing to prestige. Candace having 208, Deckenberg 392, and Jewel 9. I've played against Jewel 9 before the last game, Sweep 27. So. Pools. Should we go for pools? Very tempting. Let's do it. And by playing for pools, we've just put ourselves in a bad place because 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So 10. Any 9 pool we get, we need to put in that middle at the bottom if we want to continue with the pool game. I think we can continue building parks. What goals do we want to actually fill here? Oh, he's in too late to look at those. So two, 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 two. Oh, one, 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 six, and then one, two, six, number three. Well, let's go with not a nine park because that would ruin our pools. Or maybe we just go for it. Sure, why not? No, 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 four, four. Let's go with four. Hey, restart turn. Put a four right here. And we'll do, I hate doing a bunch of ones, so let's do twos, perhaps. Yeah, we can do twos and then separate them all up into four points each. All uh, right, the one park. Oh, another 15 pool. I think the one park might be better for us. So if we start turn, let's do the one park where it might matter even more. Right there. I think I'll get two parks fully completed, the top and the bottom. I kind of just leave the middle for just whatever, whatever land. Um, five is the most rare there. Five investment on two, so I'm, I'm stuck in. I would just want to get all twos, make it easy on myself. And a three investment. Um, maybe the sixes? Yeah, maybe I'll, uh, I like doing sixes. I could split the, the bottom one down the middle for sixes. I'm going to put a nine right there. Oh, nine, that's right. Nine right there, and then... Set myself up with two different sixes, and maybe it'll work out. Is that a construction card? Sure. I don't think that red is going to be too useful for the pool. I'm like a worm. Does it say who has the most construction? Or no, is that private information? It might just be private information. Whatever. 15 and whiz. Oh, no, I guess I'll do that. So I'll put the 15 there, and then I'll biz something else. Let's see. I'll biz that 12 right there, so that I can include more numbers in the middle. There, that kind of actually helped us out. Okay. Oh, I should have uh, been more careful, because a 2 park would have been great to put on that bottom one, but I didn't, wasn't thinking carefully. Well, let's uh, give up the pool and do a nine park there. It's the second time we've had a nine park. It's kind of a kind of funny how that happens, but if we had had a nine pool, it would have been a another odd, great option to have done. Let's just round out these parks here while we can. I'm sure 
to a, a pro watching me play, they're thinking, oh, this is really not just optimal. Especially because I'm at, sitting at 19 points and everybody else is at like 40 and 27, 28. Wow, Dickenberg really pushed forward. Dang. And uh, like last time I'm going for the number one. Well, that last time that I played this today, I'm going for the number one goal. Hey, I get to come park, so now I'm up in points. Wait, no, I'm down in points. I'm playing against a bunch of experts. Hopefully you can learn from them. Now everybody played there. That's funny. That was just the perfect place, I suppose. Five pool? Maybe not a bad idea. Sure. Let's get a little bit more points. Instead of three points, we're up to six points, so every pool from here on out is going to give at least three points. So better than parks. I don't see myself finishing any more parks. Maybe the top park. Probably not. You can try. But you can definitely try. Oh, but of course I can finish it. I'm, I'm only one away. I didn't know I was that close. Didn't think that it'd get that close. Okay. Shall I keep on pushing this construction stuff? Yeah. I'll put the seven there just for kicks, but I won't change it, obviously. So I've uh, rounded out the six. If I have any more investments, I want to max out those sixes. Um, yeah, definitely need the fifteen. <laughs> and let's do a bunch of twos. So here's our first of many twos. need every turn from here on out to create a two fence and I think we'll be good. Haven't been stolen yet. Six, seven, eight, nine. I think I'll place it right there. Yeah. And I'll put a fence lined up right here. Gotta push for these fences. seven right here because I know eights are pretty common. Build my final park and let's hope that we can I can snag the oh wow hold on waste our turn. We're gonna put that 14 pool right there and pause on our our mad dash to get fences. Should I go for a pool right now, or should I just try to seal it up with fences? I think I should try to seal it up with fences. And kill my pool. Sure. Why not? One more fence and we got it. We have it right here. Perfect. That should push us up. And that's what we needed. Okay. Now we have uh, some of the cool stuff. Maybe we try for a bunch of ones now? Or maybe we just go all twos the rest of the game. Yeah. Three ones would get us six points. I think uh, that might be a good plan. Or a two and a one. Let me just do one more two and one one. Well, we're going to be limited towards the end because that's just how this game goes. Um an investment. I could see a uh, an 11 coming out. Let's make the sixes even more powerful because we got two of them. Now I just
just realized I cut off a uh, possibility of getting another six, but that's fine. Yeah, I don't think I would have filled in the bottom row anyways. We're getting to the end where it's very limited in what we can actually fill in. Ooh, Jewel. Where is just ahead of me by taking the uh, second place for number one. What options do I have here? It says I can do any of them. Let's do an investment, right? Yes, that seems like the right move. And there I fill in a two. Now I just need to do a one, and then I can complete number three, which would be seven points. That'd be major. I'll tell you what. And very doable. Let's do this biz, and for the 14, oh no, so I had to put the 8 somewhere, so let's uh, put it right there to fill in our, our gaps, and then biz the 14, oh, is somebody ending the game right here? Somebody just said thanks for the game, does that mean we're about to end it? I don't want to respond to that. It seems like bait. <laughs> um, this could be the end. Oh, all goals have been completed by a one person. Would that would that end the game? Yeah, that is another way the game ends is if all the goals are completed by one person, right? Okay, that's weird. It didn't end by by that. I, I guess I did all right. Deckenberg won at the end, and they completed all the goals. Okay, all three goals were completed by him. I see that there. Wow. One more turn, I could have pulled out seven more points with a swing for those fences. Ha! Huh. Good game, everybody. All right, so that is the game results of Lost Seed statistics. Here they are. I think I uh, learned from that game to be watching for anybody who's already completed two because they could finish the third one and end it prematurely and get a bunch of points with that final turn obviously as well having gotten a goal having three goals and ending it usually you're probably sitting pretty good despite how well everyone else has done with their pools or whatnot i even finished two parks i thought i had done very well but um yeah i think if you can score 100 points you're doing very well on the game and i was at 91 um you know usually 100 points you've won the game so uh well, it'll be interesting to see as I go through this more often to see what ways I can kind of strategize to how to, uh, you know, not guarantee, but get very close to 100 or even figure out a method to have a high likelihood of getting 100 every game. But that'll be things to explore in the future. But thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it.